The killing of innocent civilians in Israel should be condemned, and we condemn it. The killing of innocent civilians in Palestine should also be condemned, and we must condemn it. The international community loudly and proudly condemned Russia's occupation of Ukraine when it started attacking Ukraine in 2014. Yet today, the world watches as the state of Israel deprives the entire population, men, women and children, of the basic necessities of life, food, water, electricity, gas and medicines. We must condemn it. Israeli missiles strike residential dwellings, civilians, multi-storey apartments, health facilities, as well as places of worship, indiscriminately killing men, women and children. We must condemn it. Human Rights Watch confirms that Israel is using white phosphorus in Gaza, violates the international humanitarian law pro prohibition. We must condemn it. The price tag of Israel's right to defend itself cannot be the destruction of Palestine. Israel's right to defend its civilians cannot equate to the annihilation of Palestinian, Palestinian civilians. I hereby call for an immediate ceasefire to come into effect alongside many world leaders and experts. Food, water, medicine and humanitarian aid needs to be allowed to get through and reach the victims. Mediation and talks need to start, as obviously violence has not solved anything for the past 75 years, and, just, and a just and long-lasting solution needs to be sought out.